Hi guys, Paul here from PA Brew News. Got one from the Liquid Hero Brewing Company from York, Pennsylvania. This is their Strawberry Wheat Ale or Schwiet Ale. And it is uh, 5.2 alcohol by volume. So, there we go. Apparently it is a wheat beer with strawberries. Yeah, strawberry wheat. So there. Um, see how it is? Uh, and then, of course, they're from liquidhero.com from York, Pennsylvania. Okay. I'm pretty sure they basically can everything they have. Of course, you know, with not a cask or, dra or draft, or whatever you want to call it. Okay. Well, not very weedy looking. Very clear. That's the thing I don't like about. See, I don't like clear wheat beers uh, generally because a lot of times that good nature flavor that comes from the sediment. There is some suspended sediment, more like just particleization. It's not really that nice hazy sediment, but it is in there. Extremely carbonation, so burp factory. Uh, looks a little bit thin overall because the head retention is kind of going down a little bit, but uh, let's give it a go. Huh? Let's get some aromas. No, it's strawberry. A lot of strawberry in there, there's no doubt. Okay. Okay. Well, let's see. There's a lot of strawberry in here. We'll I'll get a little bit of a twinge of wheat, but more just a strawberry. I, I mean, it is very strawberry juicy. I, I mean, like I would say, is it extract I'm smelling? That kind of strawberry flavor? Because I'm gonna get, I'm getting a little bit of like that uh, berry cereal kind of, kind of an aroma. So I am getting a little bit of that. So I can't tell whether it's real strawberry or not. But I am getting that kind of uh, little alcohol like on that one too. But I am getting that kind of aroma that you would get if you smell like cereal, like strawberry cereal, that kind of thing. All right, it's good taste. Cheers. See, that's, that's the problem. I want these things to be sweet, and they're not. It's just, it's, it's not really sweet. There's hints of the actual strawberry flavor as you drink, but it's really drying, and then at the end, you get a little bit of a sweet, that sweet wheat note. Um, their Hero Wizen was just very dry. It wasn't really sweet at all, and um, it didn't lack that good, you know, yeasty, weedy sedimentation. Would lack that, and this is kind of doing the same thing. Very carbonated, um, so that would fill you up a little bit. The carbonation, a little dry pepperiness. Um, you do get that, that again, that same taste, that cereal, that sweetened, that artificial flavor cereal with the strawberry, those kind of notes, you're getting that in there. I mean, it doesn't, it's not coming off to me as as actual strawberries. I could be wrong, of course, but that's what it's coming off as. Uh, has a very, like, dry, drying kind of character to it, and at the end of that, that's when you get the, you actually get the sweetness from the, the wheat, but it's a very dull sweetness. It's not overbearing. Yeah. Seems like the, the note that kind of carries it through um, is that strawberry flavor. Kind of helps you kind of retain a little sweetness to the end. Yeah, it's got it's got some character. It's it's a little dry, drying more so than I'd like the, the wheat beer to be. Um, I'm not pulling a lot of weed out of, out of it, except at the end. I mean, it, it definitely is coming in at the end, so that is nice. Man, those allergies have me all screwed up. Even in the head, I don't even know. I don't even know if I'm thinking right. It feels it feels like I'm not anyway. It feels like I'm completely off my game. But I can start feel I can start feeling it, that that carbonation in my stomach. But um, 
it's not a bad beer at all. It's just something that the style, I think, it's just the people who do do the style, these big, like, fruit wheat beers, I think they just, well, one thing, you got to put the big old heavy vice and sedimentation in. I think that would overall improve the whole beer. Um, and then, of course, use always, <coughs> excuse me, always use real fruit. Um, not going to say they didn't. I'm just going to say it would be great if you did. So, all in all, I think I'd give this one a 7. It's really not that bad. It's not something I would seek out or anything. But if I knew someone was coming over and they liked, like, strawberry, more fruity beers, yeah, I would pick this one up. So, 7 out of 10. It's not horrible, but it's not, it's not exactly what I would consider for the style. But it is very drinkable, and I think a lot of people actually pretty would much uh, like this, especially in a hot summer day. Yeah. The Palm Vina Brut is with the Schwiet Ale from Liquid Hero. It's going to give it a 7. 7 out of 10. Cheers.